Hey out my peeps and welcome to this video. I don't have a particular topic that I want to talk about so I hope you don't mind that but um, it is to be expected from me. But anyway, the comment of the week goes to It's Another Artist. Oh my gosh, thank you so much for your comment. I really like reading all those comments and if you would like to be the comment of the week, all you have to do is comment on any video, you know? I'm, my brain is scattered about at the moment, but anyway. This is a drawing that I did last month. Well, if you're watching this on YouTube, then it's been... I did this back in December, basically. Um, and I did, like, I did a couple of drawings kind of to... Because I still wanted to make videos while I was in school, because I'm in, I'm in school at the moment. So I, I wanted to, like, still have, you know, videos to put out for you all. So I did some drawings ahead of time, and this was one of them. It's a Copic drawing. Uh, done on Strathmore mixed media paper. Wow. Um, and this sketchbook, I don't have many pages left in it, so um, I don't want to do a sketchbook tour of this one on YouTube because like some of the drawings are really old and um, not um, <laughs> it, They are not an accurate reflection of where I am right now artistically so I don't really want to show them on YouTube but I have been thinking about sharing it on Patreon whenever I finish this inshallah so you know that's the thing it hasn't happened yet though because I haven't finished and I rarely use this sketchbook so that's why it's taken me so long like, I started this back in 2017 and uh, back in summer of 2017 and it was also the same sketchbook that I use when I was like uh, like getting into like a routine with YouTube because I did like this drawing draw daily challenge thing to kind of help me get comfortable with uploading to YouTube. I I uploaded a video every day, you know, draw daily, <laughs> and this was just like the sketchbook that I I use for that. So it's very sentimental, you know. I really like the sketchbook itself. I haven't seen it since, so I don't know if that was just like a I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, like I said, this is done with Copic markers. Um, I have this like Tombow, um, is it Tombow? No, it's not Tombow. Forget I said that. That No, I didn't say that. Where did you hear that? <laughs> this is, um, I used a zebra brush pen to do the line art and I really like using it for, for Copics. I think it's really nice. Uh, just like with all pens, you have to make sure that you let the ink dry a little bit before you use it. However, you don't have to wait super long, I find. Don't quote me on that because if if you if your drawing smudge, I'm sorry, it wasn't my fault. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, I really like using the pen for my drawings. I like um, the line weight that I get from it. I got it in a, like a pack of three a couple of years ago for Inktober, and this the one that I'm using is like the fine one. I really like the feel of this pen. I like the line weight that I get from it, and. Uh, it's not like a super flexible nib either, which is really nice and it's comfortable to work with. Because you know you get some of those brush pens and it's like, as soon as you you just barely touch the paper and the nib is just like, it just it just bends and it's like, oh my goodness, what is happening? And it's like, you don't know what to do. And then you have lines that you don't like. <laughs> um, but anyway, I don't, like I said, really like this pen. It's really nice, highly recommend. I love it, you know? And, like I said, I don't have, a, like, a particular topic to talk about today, so I am just... What, how do you say that? <laughs> I'm just winging it. That's how you say it. But anyway, I haven't started coloring it, so I don't, I don't want to talk about that just yet. But anyway, um, if I recall correctly, I wanted to draw an elf because I, I used to draw a lot of, like, elves, elves, <laughs> elves and things, and I stopped for some reason. I don't really know why, and... Like every like I just I guess that's just like a normal thing. You just like go through phases with your art and I had an elf phase, so uh I guess I phased out. But I really wanted to draw another elf because it's like I like elves. I wanna draw one, so I did. So it looks like I'm about to break out the Copic markers and I have a tutorial on my channel that I did a not too not too long ago, uh, about how to color black people with Copic markers, so if that's something you're interested in, I'll put it in the iCard. You can check that out if you like. 
Um, but anyway, I was going somewhere with that, but I can't remember. <laughs> oh my gosh. What is... Like, I actually cannot remember. I don't know if I should be concerned. But anyway. Um, oh yeah, now I remember. It had nothing to do with Copix. <laughs> um, like I mentioned earlier, like, this video has absolutely no theme. And I've mentioned this a few times. Uh, like, sometimes I just, like, struggle a little bit with coming up with commentary. Especially for videos like this where it's, like, pre-recorded and... You know, it's been a while since I drew it, so I, like I can't remember a lot of things. Like you just, you just witnessed this, just forgetting things quickly. So of course I can't remember. I did something I did back in December. But anyway, um, if you have any suggestions for topics you would like to, me to talk about on my channel, um, I'd love to hear them. So yeah, you know, if you got, if you got them, I'll take them. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, back to the drawing, if I can remember how I did this. I really like how your dress turned out. I think it's really nice. Actually, it was... That's what Bob Ross meant when he said, happy accidents. He was talking, he said that for this particular moment. He didn't, but like, you know what I mean. But anyway, the dress, like the... Is that called the bodice? I'm not sure. The front part, not the sleeves, but just, you know what I mean. <laughs> anyway, my marker was dry. I've been having this issue with my markers because I haven't purchased any refills for them so my markers are just, they're on their last leg. They're not even on no, their last leg. They're on their last, I don't know, their last something. They're, they're challenged at the moment and they really need assistance. But I made it work this time so with the darker purpley color, um, it was drawing out and it was like, oh no. Um, I need to fill this area so I kind of used that to my advantage and kind of um, did like a like I went horizontally across the the dress I hope this makes sense <laughs> and I like blended it with a lighter color so it looks like it's like a crinkly shiny kind of fabric which I think is really neat and it was a you know a neat thing to have done considering the fact that my markers as I mentioned, need some help. Oh my gosh, they are like, I just like, I've had some of these colors, now that I think about it, since I had the sketchbook, since before I, I had the sketchbook, and that was like, if I can math real quick, <laughs> four years ago. I couldn't math for a moment, but I got it. But anyway, so like four years ago, I got some of these markers and I never purchased refills for them. So of course they need assistance. Of course they are dry. This isn't Copic's fault. This is my own fault, and I I should just I don't know. Just. Uh, this is how the drawing turned out. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you didn't mind the commentary. I know I'm sorry, but like I said, if you have any suggestions for commentary for future videos, I would love to hear it. I want to hear it. Please assist me. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I hope you got something out of it, and I hope it was entertaining. You know. Uh, shout out to my patrons, Turtle Bun Buns, Ariana, and Kelsey. Wow, thank you for being my patrons. I really appreciate you and everything that you do. My goodness. I'm also on Instagram, and I'm also on Coffee, and you can also subscribe to my channel if you want to. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and please enjoy the rest of your day, my peeps.